Hey YouTube. So I'm going to do, this is a video on how I see peak oil. And in case you don't know or never heard of that term, it's not a theory. It's a fact that eventually, because oil is non-renewable and oil is used for many, many things, it's not just made for our cars for gas. It's from all kinds of products, everything, even my braces, clear, even my clear plastic braces are made of oil. All plastic materials are made of oil. So if you can imagine, that's pretty much everything. Paints, tires, parts for cars, everything is made of oil. So whenever somebody says, oh, it'll be okay because we're just switched to solar panels or you know battery solar panel cars or something like that but what they don't know or understand is that all that takes oil as well so a lot of people will be in denial a lot of people don't understand a lot of people will be angry a lot of people will do bargaining in their heads and think well and they'll make excuses like oh but we can do this that and the other the only way I see out of this problem of running out of oil is if we ever have like a super intelligent AI that can solve the problem because I don't think any human can solve this problem unless we had a sun in a box and we could make things out of thin air without using oil, without using plastics. That's our only hope. And so that would tell me that it would take some kind of super AI to do it because it could take us millions of years, and we don't have millions and millions of years to figure out this problem, but AI can. AI could figure out a million year problem that would take us a million years in no time, zero time at all, if we had a super AI uh, technology that is. We don't right now at all. Nothing like even that even comes close to super AI. Um, but they're working on it. So I'm not saying that it's hopeless. I'm just saying. And the way I see it, how it will play out, is that it already is. And what I mean by that is that certain countries, certain, even some states, take like um, Michigan, for example, certain economies will die. Um, Many countries will fall and there'll be mass immigration due to lack of jobs because I don't really see it in terms of work. I don't, my mind doesn't think that way. The way my mind thinks is energy. Um, when I think of money, I don't think of money as in paper. I think of in terms of energy. When I think of jobs, I don't think in terms of creating work for someone to do or having a need for someone to do some kind of work. I think when I'm thinking of peak oil, I think in terms of energy. So in order to grow an economy, grow jobs, grow demand, grow resources, it all takes oil. So when the oil gets to a peak, meaning you can no longer extract more oil from the ground, you have a plateau. And when you have a plateau, economies will fail, states will fail, governments will fall, countries will fall. Why? Because you can no longer grow that economy. Our economy is based on growth, our money system is based on growth, which again is based on endless supplies of continuously growing more and more each year oil supplies. When you can no longer do that and you plateau, meaning you can no longer extract as much oil as you previously did in the previous years of growth, that's called peak oil and that's where you have the plateau. Now, the really scary thing is what happens when this plateau starts to go down and we actually start producing less and less and less oil each year? That's scary because nobody knows what's going to happen. 
I would say that this earth can probably not sustain how many people are on this earth now? What, uh, eight, nine billion or something like that? That's nuts because there's no way at all. Again, unless I, unless we have some kind of super AI quantum computer that can figure this stuff out and make things out of thin air and have like a sun in a box for our energy. That's basically the only way. And even then, we have other issues, problems, because people don't understand the exponential growth factor. People don't, minds don't think that way. I don't, can't help but think that way. And it, it frustrates me that other people can't see it. And that is a problem. Take care.